Hi, everybody. We're doing our senior design project over an agricultural robot. Some of the potential applications that we had envisioned for our project were to help assist in repopulating affected forests, assisting farmers planting various crops and watering these crops. So we used a one tenth scale RC car because it met our requirements and our needs to be able to make a seed planting robot. We then mounted the lead screw and a guide rail for carrying the drill motor. We attached a seed dispenser. So we actually 3D printed a bracket that held our lead screw. We 3D printed a bracket that held a stepper motor to our lead screw and our whole seed dispenser itself was 3D printed. For example, the lead screw and the drill uh, needed to be calibrated so it was at the right height. So when, you, when we execute the program, it would only drill about a quarter of an inch down. And, uh, the brush wheel for the, the dispenses of seeds also needed to be uh, calibrated for a certain number of rotations, so it didn't dispense too many at one time. And the solenoid we used to, uh, to control how quickly the water came out. On the left, you see the you can see the uh, the drill working and how uh, and see it going into the ground there. But on the right, you can see the seed dispenser working. Um, we had for for our video, we had it dispense um, a larger pile of seeds, about 20 instead of about two, like we normally would, just so it would show up on the video. And you can see there at the bottom, you can see the hole with the seeds in the water there. We also implemented a camera on the front of this. Uh, so when, you're, when you were remote controlling it, um, you could see where you're going. And so we have an example of some of the video from that camera. So to show you what it look, would look like if you were just doing the remote control and moving it and navigating it before doing the, the planting.